Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable of condolences to the UAE President and Supreme Commander of the UAE Armed Forces, His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nahyan, in which His Majesty the King expressed sincere condolences for the martyrdom of six Emirati servicemen who died in a collision while performing their national duty and operations. His Majesty prayed the Allah Almighty to bestow His mercy on their souls, make paradise their last abode, and grant patience and solace to their families. His Majesty the King also praised the active role of the United Arab Emirates within the Arab Coalition forces to re-support legitimacy in Yemen led by Saudi Arabia in a way that preserves Yemen's so sovereignty, unity, and territorial integrity. His Majesty also sent a cable to the UAE Vice President, Prime Minister and Dubai Ruler, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, in which His Majesty extended heartfelt condolences for the martyrdom of the six Emirati servicemen. His Majesty sent a similar cable to the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi, Deputy Supreme Commander of the Armed Forces of the UAE, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nahyan, in which His Majesty extended his sincere condolences for the martyrdom of the six Emirati servicemen. His Majesty the King hailed the role of the United Arab Emirates within the Arab Coalition forces and reiterated Bahrain's firm stance with the forces of the coalition led by Saudi Arabia and preserving Yemen's unity. The court of the Crown Prince announced today that His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa will make an official visit to the United States of America. During the visit, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince will meet with the President of the United States, Donald Trump, as well as other senior U.S. officials, further strengthening the long-standing bilateral ties. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince will be accompanied by a high-level delegation. The Aga Khan 2019 Award for Architecture was announced today, which included the Muharraq Revitalization Project, along with five other projects from different countries during a ceremony held in the Russian city of Kazan. The president of the Bahrain Authority for Culture and Antiquities, Sheikh Hamay bint Mohammed Al Khalifa, received the award. This comes following the success of the project of the pearl fishing route, a witness to an island's economy. For shedding light on the history of pearl fishing at the World Heritage Site, as well as its ability to rebalance the demographic composition within the alleys of Muharraq. The project aimed at preserving a number of heritage and cultural sites and buildings, from modest divers' homes to magnificent courtyard residences to commercial warehouses, in addition to upgrading other vital facades.